Hey farm friends, happy Father's Day. Tomorrow's Father's Day and I just wanted to wish you a happy Father's Day from the farm. But I want to tell you the best thing about being, some of the best things about being a dad. And so stay tuned and, and I'll share some of my insights and feelings about being a dad. Well, probably one of the best things about being a dad is later you become a grandpa. Hey Cameron, you wanna say hi to everybody? You see yourself right here? Look at that. You look pretty serious. Good. Yeah. <laughs> there you are. Well guys, happy Father's Day. I'm sitting on this little lawnmower, riding lawnmower that Vicki and the kids got me for Father's Day. I'm the most blessed dad on, on the planet. And uh, not because, just because I got this riding lawnmower, even though I'm excited about that. But I'm just gonna share with you some of my insights about being a dad. And uh, anyway, being a, being a dad's the, the best thing ever. And uh, so anyway, I may speak kind of bluntly. I know this is a YouTube channel, but I have some pretty strong feelings about this. Any anyone can become a, a dad or become a father even you know just any, any one of billy goats uh or any stud that i buy out there on the reservation can can father a offspring but to be a real dad means you take time one of the leaders of our church one time said that love is spelled t-i-m-e and i totally agree with that what do you think, Cameron? Do you agree? You want your dad and grandpa to spend some time with you, huh? Yeah. So, so dads, as tomorrow's Father's Day, the best thing you can do for your kids is spend some time with them. And not just some time, a lot of time. Uh, one of the best things about having a farm has been that I've got to spend so much time with my kids, teaching them how to work and just spending time with them and learning about life and learning from my kids and with my kids it's been awesome so so that's one thing i wanted to talk about the other thing and i learned this from my own dad is that you know tomorrow's father's day and a few dads are expecting something some gift or think that you are something special tomorrow really it didn't take much for us to become dads um but the women in our life our wives they're just remarkable and uh my dad was always good i'm the oldest of 10 kids and my dad was always so good to remind us kids that uh, there you go bud he was always so good to remind us hey on your birthday remember you didn't do anything to to come into this world but your mom sure gave a, a lot she uh she faced six nine months of uh horrible health in many situations vicky was on bed rest for two of our children and had some serious medical issues with all of them and, and anyway um yeah tomorrow's father's day but i want to thank vicky and thank all the moms out there because really sorry this wind's bad i'm doing this video without vicky knowing uh, that's another thing Vicky edits our videos and makes them look nice and sound good and all that stuff and I thought you know what I'm gonna surprise her and do a little video just because it'll be one last thing she has to do and uh, earlier this week she hired some kids to come help clean up the yard for me she bought me this little riding mower she always does so much for me it's just amazing but so number one dads spend time with your kids and uh, if you haven't been doing that then repent um, Get off the couch and go get off your, your stupid video games. Sorry. There you go, Cameron. Here's my, my son, Bryson, coming to get his son, Cameron, now. It's just the circle of life here. So fun. Say hi. 
<laughs> hey Cameron, thanks for riding with me, buddy. Good, Good job. job. Bye, bud. I'm just giving a little Father's Day message and that'll be done. Anyway, so first thing I, like I said, is uh, spend some time with, a lot of time with your kids. Turn off your video games and your television. I had someone the other day ask me, how do you guys get so much done? And I said, well, we don't have a TV in the house. And uh, that's true, we, well, kind of true. We do have a TV, it's not even plugged in, but if we wanna watch a movie, a video sometime or whatever, we will hook it up. But, but I think technology, as good as it is, has also been such a negative. So many, so many dads are spending time on video games or watching sports and they're not instead of playing sports with their kids or teaching them how to work so anyway so fathers spend some time with your kids tomorrow yes it's father's day but it's not it's not your day it's it's a day to remember what good dads do and uh, anyway the second thing is like i said even though it's father's day remember the women in your lives your mom your wife your girlfriend whatever but but that's another thing i feel strongly about is our society would be so much better if if uh men and women would get married and stay married and and love their spouse and treat their spouse with kindness and respect and so that's my father's day message is if you're really a great father then then love your your wife love the the mother of your children and uh Anyway, it seems like there was something else I wanted to say. The other thing I was going to say is just, you know what? Being a dad is just the greatest thing ever. Seeing your kids succeed and, and try hard. And sometimes they trip and stumble and fall, but they, they get back up and they keep trying. And uh, anyway, I love my kids so much and so grateful for them. Um, most of you that watch our channel probably know I have two sons and two daughters and now I have two grandsons and a son-in-law and a daughter-in-law and I love them all they're just amazing and seriously if there's any of you out there especially you young adults that think you're too cool to get married or think that having kids is going to tie you down you're missing out on the best best part of life so anyway love my kids and so grateful for them and being a dad is just the best thing in the world and i wouldn't be a dad without vicky i love vicky she's amazing and uh i hope you've enjoyed our channel we hit 20,000 subscribers last night i think and uh, i just can't believe so many of you support our channel but we, we don't hide what we believe in and that is faith family freedom fun farm food I think I said them all. Blake would add firearms and females, but anyway. Um, have a happy Father's Day, and if I've said anything that offends you, then be offended or, or change it, and uh, go repent. So anyway, have a happy Father's Day. See y'all.